Today, we are going to talk about the people who are around us because God made us to be around people. God wants us to have friends and he wants us to have families. And there's a story in the Bible about a man who had some really good friends that brought him closer to Jesus and changed his life forever. You guys just heard this story or maybe even you read it. The man couldn't walk because he was paralyzed. He knew he had to get to Jesus, but there was no way he could do it alone. And lucky for him, this man had a few really good friends. His friends carried him on a mat to the place Jesus was preaching at. And then they went the extra mile and did something really amazing to help their friend get to Jesus. They climbed up onto the roof, dug a hole in the roof, lowered the mat with their friend on it through the ceiling and put him at Jesus' feet. And then Jesus performed a miracle and he healed him. You guys may never need to dig a hole in a roof and throw one of your friends through it. But here are some other ways that you can help your friends get closer to Jesus. You can pray for them and you can encourage them when they are sad. You can tell them about Jesus and the Bible and you can invite them to church and you can do kind things for them. The man in today's Bible story had a problem. He needed to get to Jesus, but he couldn't do it by himself. He couldn't get there on his own. He needed some help. It's kind of like this. There's some ice in this cup and this one is empty. Do you think I can get one of these ice cubes from this cup to this cup without touching the cups or the ice? It seems impossible, but there's a little trick to it and I need some help. You need a piece of yarn. I have to tie a knot in mine to make it a little easier and then some salt. What you're gonna do is you're gonna take your string you're gonna set it on one of the ice cubes, and then you're gonna pour a whole bunch of salt on there, like about a teaspoon. And then you wait for one minute. All right, welcome back, it's been one minute. So we've waited one minute, now let's see if we can move it from here to here without touching the ice cube. Pull up on your string. There we go, we did it. I want you guys to try that at home. Tell me what you think. It took a lot of practice, so I wanna see you guys do it too. The four friends in the Bible story today had to pick up their friend and carry him to Jesus, just like I just used the string to move the ice cube. Without his friends, this man would never have made it to Jesus. And without the salt, we could have never picked up the ice. God made us to need other people. God made us to need other people. Whether it's sports or recess or school or growing in our faith, I am so glad that doesn't want us to live or follow him all alone on our own. God has given us other people to have relationships with and to help us grow closer to him. I hope you all have a happy Sunday and a great week. Remember there's some more things that you guys can do, some things that you can talk about and things to do with your family. So I hope you check those out and let me know what you think. Bye guys, have a great week.